Well, that went more smoothly than expected. We'll send the men who can still fight to mop up the rest of the enemy. Ah, made it through safe and sound, I see. That's a relief. Indeed. But at no small cost. I should also say, a report came in that Shinsoku has passed away. To think he too has left us. They say he was keen to hear news of the battle up till his very last moments. Sadly, we don't have the time to mourn him just yet. Thanks to our victory, the word we've been trying to forge is right around the corner. And it appears the Demon Claw Samurai's assault on Yodo Castle didn't harm our cause either. Well, that's more or less the size of it. I'm sure they're up to something. But regardless, Yodo Castle was a great opportunity to turn the tide. We'll gather our forces and chase down the Tokugawa. Whatever orders might come our way, attacking Edo is unavoidable now. The samurai with the Demon Claw will no doubt be headed there too in pursuit of Lord Yoshinobu. You are on the trail, right? What do you say to traveling to Edo together? I've heard Lord Yoshinobu was badly wounded. That means it's Katsukaishu calling the shots. We need to find out what he's planning. Katsu is liable to take drastic measures, like a cornered rat. I'm counting on you to make contact with him in Edo. I know you can do it. Shogun's life is not in danger, but still he must rest up for now. I just can't understand it. Why didn't we stand and fight? With my fleet, it was a battle we could have won! We were following the Shogun's orders. He did not wish for us to fight. And frankly, Enomoto, I believe he means to lay down his very life for the million citizens of Nedo. And you will allow this? You are a samurai! Is it not your duty to protect your lord and master? It is indeed. And that's why I have a very important job for you. Minamoto must take his excellency and his men to safety overseas. The people of Edo, too, should use what ships they have to escape. Escape, you say? You can't be serious. After that, we will set Edo ablaze. I have already told Chief Tatsugoro of the Firefighters our plan. We will destroy anything useful to our enemies. When they are weakened, we'll have a chance to negotiate. You really mean to sacrifice Edo? If Edo were to become a battlefield, it would be utter carnage. Countless citizens would perish. No, this is the only way. The restoration is nigh and all shall burn. The Sekihotai will see it done. Ah, it's you. Ah, someone's back in Edo, I see. <laughs> 
didn't think you'd be likely to come here again. Look, this might seem sudden, but you need to leave Edo. I've got to get every man, woman, and child out of here. Once everyone's gone, we're burning it to the ground. That's the plan, at least. Unfortunately, we can't protect both the city and its people. And this is our only chance to stop the Alliance from finishing us off for good. Good, because I've made up my mind. Who am I trying to kid? Look, I can't bear the thought of burning down the town where I was born and raised. But I owe it to the troops under my command to take decisive action. I need to ask Tatsugoro for his help too. But if he heard this talk, I know he'd be furious. At any rate, we have a few days before the Alliance descend on Edo. I have to prepare as best I can. The British have strong ties to the Alliance, so I'll see if they'd be willing to help us broker a peace. I've got to get Sato, the interpreter, on our side. And then, I have to cool down the Shinsengumi. They're gathering in numbers, chomping at the bit to get revenge for Kondo. If I let them take up arms, all Edo will descend into chaos. I've sent Brunei to talk sense into them, but he'll have an uphill battle. Apologies for interrupting, sir. The group calling themselves the Sekihotai have entered Edo Castle. They're headed to the inner chamber. Reports say their target is Princess Atsuko. Ah, uh, she's a former Shogun's wife and a key figure of the Satsuma clan. Uh, I'm not sure what their plan is, but this is bound to rile up her clansmen. Her Highness's escort is undermanned and requires assistance. The Shinshogumi may have stalled the Sekiotai, but it is only a matter of time. A group of Roshigumi warriors returned from Kyoto, who formed around Koto Nakazawa. They're tasked with policing the streets and guarding Edo Castle. Good. I appreciate it. And what's more, I trust you. Get to Edo Castle as quick as you can and drive off the Sekihotai. Nakazawa can fill in the details when you arrive. I know you just got back. Sorry you walked right into this. If we survive this, drinks are on me. Oh, and there's something else I want to run by you. Come see me about it later. What are you doing here? <laughs> Sounds about right. I plan on putting you to work then. There's a hidden passage close by that leads inside the castle. It'll be quicker to reach the inner chamber that way than storming in from the front. You can still make it if you hurry. Can you head straight to Princess Atsuko's chambers and get her out? Be on your guard. I'm sure our enemies have found the passage by now. All set? Let's begin.
Excellent.
rescued by you once again. How should I thank you, I wonder? Now let me ask. Why were they after me? I see. By getting rid of me, a word of the Shogunate, they conspire to rile up Psycho and the rest. The revolutionist army would rush to arms and Edo would be reduced to a sea of flames. I cannot allow all those fighting to make this country a better place, to keep harming one another. Right. I'll start by writing a letter to Saigo, and put down on paper how I truly feel about the state of affairs. I know he'll take my advice. Please, make sure he gets it. the news from the Shinshogumi, but I was hoping you could fill me in on some of the details. Dependable as ever! Thank you. I'm sure Princess Atsuko herself has an even higher opinion of you. <laughs> now, we need to prepare a location for talks to take place. Saigo is saying he won't stop fighting until the Shogunate has been ground to dust. What? Is that really from her? Well, coming from Princess Atsuko, this might actually hit home. My friend, you've only gone and solved it! The main Satsuma force has set up camp in the Kanagawa post before they move on Edo. They've got British-made artillery and battleships. Saigo's bound to be there. Now, it won't be easy to get that letter to him. Can I count on you? You're holding the lives of Edo's people in your hands. I'm betting it all on you. Let's go. Useful, I promise.
for the trouble. <laughs> Enough of this already! died as you lived. I hear you've been busy in Edo. Have you come to kill me?
cannot be rebuilt unless we uproot the Tokugawa. Truly are a gorgeous is wiser than us all. I have read her message. Now, I must speak to Katsu. Saigo has sent word back that he's ready to negotiate. In truth, I already had high hopes. But you still outdone yourself. Princess Atsuko, Saigo, and I, we could never have achieved this, no matter how hard we tried. The fact that we've been able to come this far is all down to the bonds that you have forged. There are things one cannot accomplish alone. But a strong bond makes both parties involved stronger. The bonds you forged are a true blessing, and they're the difference between you and your old partner. I want to settle things between the Shogunate and the new administration. We need less fighting and more talking. It won't be easy, but what choice is there? But I fear the Demon Claw Samurai is bound to intervene. That's why I want you there. To end this once and for all. Right. It's do or die for the both of us tonight. By the way, some of your acquaintances are hoping for a word with you. The negotiations with Psycho aren't set to begin just yet. I'm sure you have much to discuss, so I'll leave you be. I've come to see you in Ryoma's stead. I thought he'd want to know how you're doing. Ryoma called you his partner, right? Vexing as it is, 
I'm not sure I could measure up. I know he'll be watching over you. Till this wrong night ends and a new dawn breaks. Don't do anything crazy. Oh, hello there. Think of all the lives that are lost so easily in war. But saving a life is a different matter. It requires real effort. I've tried everything to save my patients. So I know from experience that miracles do not just happen. They are made to happen. A lot of people are looking for you for just such a miracle. So go out and do it. But make sure you come back safe. Orders have come from the homeland to withdraw from Japan. But I'm of no mind to live. I have found a way forward. After encountering the Shinsengumi, we formed the Dragon Corps, the battalion of my dreams. We'll depart soon and work to become the Samurai of the New Age. I trust you will follow your own path. Farewell. If you have work to do, then go. Katsu will go down in history for all he has achieved, I am sure. Truly, one's status and birth need not hinder one's potential. If we all had his capacity to make our dreams a reality, this country would be transformed. Don't you think? Imagine if we could all emulate his example. But I do not see why this should remain but a dream. No, I will make it so myself. That is all. Till next time. A new battle is just breaking out. Not that of the Satsuma Choshu Alliance, but one of commerce. Soon, we'll be fending off merchants and traders from all over the world. <laughs> I expect to have my hands full indeed. But that's still yet to come. You must conclude your own battle first. Leave the future to me, and give all you can to the here and now. Stay well. As technology advances, it can be used to harm men, and even stir up great wars. But a fact remains that it can be used to save men, too. In the end, it is a tool, and we decide their use. I choose to trust in people, in their hearts. And so I continue my work. Speaking of which, I have a new invention in the works. Come on, have a gander once you are able to rest your sword. All right, then. Be seeing you. It's you. Hey! Surprised to see me here? I wasn't going to simply lie still, no matter how grave my wounds. 
can't go down in history as the Shogun who ran away, can I now? I will be satisfied as long as Edo. No, this country doesn't go up in flames. I'm grateful to you for keeping that hope alive. I thank you. If I had been born of a lower station, how I would have liked to have journeyed with you, as Ronin, together. Best of luck. Our business here is done. It was a tough choice, but Saigo has decided to participate in the talks. It all came down to the letter you delivered from Princess Atsuko. A world in which those who fought for others get their just reward. In those words, Saigo and I both saw the shape this country should take. Far too many have died in order for us to get here. I pray what comes next will live up to both their hopes and ours. And that your efforts will be rewarded. That concludes business. I've... been thinking about it for some time. Why do those who seek peace... go to war? I don't have the answer, but I know you're always risking your life for a peaceful world. That much is painfully clear. Knowing that much, I can almost glimpse the answer. Come back safe, please. You have to. Oh, good to see you safe and sound. I thought I should catch up with you when I was checking on things in Edo. I have always chosen what I believe to be the best course. But I know many men have lost their lives because of my choices. I want to help make a world where all can see their deaths were not in vain. I need you to know that. Don't fuss. Just come. Hey! Have you met with everyone you wanted? When you're ready, head to the Satsuma base. No need to be so stiff. It's the difficult things that end up the most interesting. Never be so uptight, you can't enjoy the moment. Right then, let's go. This is no time for games or evasions. Let us be straight with each other. Naturally, I came with the same intention. So let us talk. First, the new administration's requests.
understand me? You of all people! Give it up! I will fight for a new day! Without war, what purpose, what world would we have? I must be the one to kill you! I will stop you, no matter what! to make a world where we could live together. Just let me die by your hand.
The age of the samurai draws to a close. But the samurai spirit lives on, and new horizons await. Following the talks between Kaishu Katsu and Takamori Saigo, the shogunate forces surrender Edo Castle. With that, those who dreamed of a new dawn for Japan succeed in avoiding full-blown war in Edo, saving countless lives. <laughs>